How's it going, guys? Back where we left off on the uh, airship on our way to Limblum. Or. Wait. I don't know. We'll see where we're on our way to. Anyways, let's keep it going. Last time we already did everything else. This is going to be a lengthy part. At last, Queen Braun is sure to be pleased. However, the princess would have been left behind without the thief's aid. I shall petition for a life sentence on his behalf. Yes, that would be the honorable thing. But that was because the crew wouldn't listen. I must run a background check on them. Ah, uh, yes, it is my duty as a knight. What the? Alright. This is the fun part. Uh-oh. Looks pretty familiar. Y y what's wrong? Something stuck in your throat? You insolent fool. Turn the ship around. Ah. I will have your head for that. Hey, I think we upset them. They didn't respond to anything until now. You're the one who started this trouble. I apologize. Please wait. I will take this fool into custody and turn the ship around. What's wrong? Phoebe, are you okay? So, number two was defeated by a small child. You are no match against my power. Ha 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 ha, princess, stay here while I eliminate this child. Are you protecting him? Nonsense, you are no different from mindless dogs. What can you do? Get out of my way. Do you dare fight a black wall? I said, get out of my way! Now this fight can take a long time, because there's three things you can steal from him. Steepled hat, linen curl, curia, ugh. Anyways, and silver gloves. And you're gonna wanna try to steal all three, especially the silver gloves, and you only have a 6.25 chance of successfully stealing those. So, you're gonna want to heal with garnet, obviously, or dagger, whatever you wanna call it. And, uh, you're gonna wanna use healing items as well with everyone else until you successfully steal the items. I suggest all three at least get the silver blood. Um, yeah, you're gonna start off the fight in trance though with BB, so feel free to use up those spells. Just make sure you don't kill the boss. He has 1128 HP though, so you can use off your trance spells and not worry about killing him. Just after you use those, go back and defend them until you steal everything. But anyways, what cool do Ah. Master Vivi, I shall assist you. Hey, you guys. Dagger. Yes? We'll take care of the black walls. You steal the shit. I think we're gonna get even more dangerous from here on. It's not too late to turn back. 
you can go back to the castle and cross South Gate in the living room. It's your choice. I'll be with you either way, but try not to crash the ship. Oh boy, here we go, guys. Guess you don't actually use Garnet, so guess we can't heal. Them. Why? Why would you do such a thing? Weren't they your friends? You fool. Do I look like some lowly black mage soldier? Even if they weren't your allies, what you did was re rehab. Ho oh, ho. Completely skip that word. <laughs> Worry not about them. Many more are being produced even now. What are you? Ah, the princess's bodyguards have gathered. A very convenient. Answer me. Wouldn't do you any good if I answered, since you're all going to die. <laughs> I'll eliminate any who stand in my way. Alright. This is gonna be an interesting one. spell us at all so you don't have to worry about casting on him. up in the air like that, the next belly cast is going to hit everybody in the party, just so you guys know. And it's probably going to hurt pretty bad. Oh, that was <laughs> nothing. We got the silver gloves! That's exactly what we needed, that's crazy. I figured I was going to have to re-record this video like three or four times, and this is only the first, so... Wow. I just gotta not blow it, get the one last item, which isn't as important, but I still want it. <laughs> Couldn't steal anything, of course. You guys might notice in this one compared to all the other previous games the fight timing is a little off seems like they give you a little too much time in between moves but it's all good i guess all right we stole everything now it's time to wreck this guy i almost stole again i'm so used to stealing Uh-oh. Here we go, guys. This isn't going to be a very long fight anymore. He should be dead after this move is not next.
like I said in the previous video, you can see how power leveling will work out pretty well. I got a couple levels off camera before we recorded one of the previous videos. And you saw how much easier that made the fight. Anyways, you scum. I exist only to kill. Just how many Black Walters do we have to fight? This is becoming ridiculous. I think that was the last one. How do you know? Are you... You said Waltz, right? Don't you think number three would be the last one? I can see Southgate. She's got gonna go for it. Or, let's go for it. <laughs> I don't know. That I did see. Did you see that? Our enhanced black pages. Our black pages enhancements. All defeated. Betrayed us, Steiner did. It's all his fault. Huh? Unstable the ship becomes. Don't let go of the steering wheel. Number three is coming back. True, is it? Hooray. But something is wrong. It's broken. It made its magic too powerful, we did. There's nothing we can do now. Depart, shall we? We shall depart. Run away! I exist only to kill, I exist only to kill, I exist only to kill, I exist only to kill! Do you see the south gate? Yes. Southgate is a huge gate built exclusively for airships, but maneuvering through it could be tricky. Do you want me to do it, Dagger? I want to do it on my own. Alright. We don't have the clearance. They might close the gate on us. Should be okay, though. Security was totally lax when I came through here on the theater ship. It'll be fine, Captain Dagger. Roger. It's old, but the engine's got power. We must turn back. Princess, please turn the ship around. The Black Waltz is heading straight towards us on an airship. He might crash into us. Dagger, Rusty's right. It's heading straight for us. Punch it. Go through South Gate. Don't be ridiculous. What if the gate closes on us? There's no way we can outmaneuver him on this cargo ship. We'll slide in before the gate closes and shut him out. That's our only chance. Rusty, turn the power up to max that lever over there. Dagger, stay on course no matter what. Okay. I know we can make it. As you can see, Vivi's a little depressed right now. Understand, Lisa. himself. <laughs> Ugh. 
just in case you're wondering. I'm not controlling this right now. It's going on its own. Finally, the Limblum Grand Castle. Why so silent, people? I think we pushed it a little too hard. Is what he said before that. <laughs> we made it. Come on, cheer up. Southgate was badly damaged. It was my fault, wasn't it? Don't worry about it. They'll fix it up in no time. You idiot! The cargo ship was wrecked. We lost all the cargo and Southgate was destroyed. I can't believe I played a part in this debacle. Steiner. Yes, Princess. I didn't mean to get you involved, but you saved us. I thank you. Such kind words. I am not worthy. <laughs> Well now, I've made up my mind. I vow to protect you, Princess, until we return to the castle. How do you feel about that dagger? They'll follow you to the end of the world. It's okay, Zidane. Hey, I can see the main gate of Limblum. That's Limblum Castle. How gigantic. The city of Limblum is inside the castle. I guess Dagger and I will go our separate ways once we reach Limblum. Let's see. Oh, well, I guess since these are in, you know, these are supposed to be the thoughts, so I won't read them. I'll just let you guys read them. Exciting. Those black mages and I, are we the same? I don't understand, Master TV. Just what seems to be the problem? I don't know. Master Phoebe, why would those mages be the same as you? And why would it matter if they were? Rusty's right. You're an individual, no matter what happens, Phoebe. Right. Let's get out of there. Let's go out to the deck, Phoebe. You've got to see Limbo above. It's the best. Look at the Falcon's Gate right in front of us. is huge. It's even bigger than Alexandria Castle. Yeah, they don't call it Little Grand Castle for nothing. An indoor airship dock? This is truly amazing. Even Her Majesty's Red Rose wouldn't e would easily fit in here. Dagger, you don't look too impressed. Have you been here before? Yes, I came here a few times when I was little. I haven't been here since my father passed away. Here comes the welcoming committee. A really old airship. Greetings, I am Princess Garnet, Tell Alexandra. I humbly request an audience with Regent Sid. You must be kidding. No member of the royal family, let alone a princess, would ever ride in such a shabby airship. Look at the company you are keeping. How dare you accuse the princess of lying? The princess was forced to come here under extreme circumstances. And show me some kind of proof of your royal heritage. Very well. This pendant. Is it a falcon claw? No, the shape is a little different. Call Mi Minister Artani. If you weren't such a filthy looking oaf, they would not be so suspicious of us. Hey, I'm not the idiot with the loud voice and the dirty, rusty armor. What? <laughs> what is going on? 
sir. We have no unknown visitors who wish to see the region, and one of them is carrying a pendant that looks like a falcon claw. You are dismissed. I'll take care of this. Yes, sir. Uncle Artania, it's good to see you, princess. Please follow me. The region is waiting. Blessing of Water by Malicio, the court artisan, celebrating 20 years of rule under Sid the Ninth. Hmm, looks like there's no place to insert the metal. Steepled hat won't teach us anything, so we'll keep the feathered hat on for now. This, on the other hand, will teach us anti body. Slip real quick. We're still learning our stuff on him as well from the feathered hat. This will teach him two things, so we're probably going to give him the glass armlet for now. Well, now he's still finishing off leather wrist. Hmm. We're going to keep that on, obviously. Still not done with that, unfortunately. Still not done. Okay, we can equip the silver gloves. That's good. We stole that from the last boss. Man, we can equip this. She's not learning anything from Feathered Hat, so we'll give her the steeple, one of the steeple hats for now. back on her because if you notice it steep hat lowers her spirit leather wrist she's not getting anything from she would get antibody from the glass armlet silk shirt nothing new there okay so basically I think we're gonna give the glass armlet to BB for now Don't forget to equip the everyone's new abilities. already maxed out. Alright guys, and that's how you do that. Save up here, it's been a while. Every time I cut a video it doesn't necessarily mean I stop playing, I just like to cut the videos between 30 and 40. Sometimes 45 minutes, depending on the air. So, yeah, it's been a while since I've saved. Uh, 
last time the save was four hours and 57 minutes in, now with five minutes, or five hours and 56 minutes in. We have a letter for him. From Kumap to Magki. Stiltskin visited Ikupo. He said he found a place that seemed interesting. And then he left. I wish he stayed longer. Where did he go anyway? Let me know when you find out. Stiltskin, Stiltskin, Kupo, Kupo. I wonder if he stopped in Limbo. You want to deliver to Atla? Okay. There we go. That's all we can do for now, so there is going to be a ton of cutscenes from here on out, just so you guys know. Limboom Castle is three levels, all connected by this lift. From the base level, which lies below the mist, you can take a trolley to the harbor and back gate. Ships hardly arrive at the harbor anymore since travel by air has become so popular. The mist possesses great danger, so we've sealed off everything. Just above the base level is the mid-level. You can ride the air cab from the mid-level to go to town. The upper level contains the royal chamber and conference room. Access that to that level is restricted because the region himself resides there. Hey Dagger, what's Regent Sid like? I lived in Lidlum for a while, but I've never met him. Regent Sid is very wise. He always thinks ahead. He may seem a bit odd at times, but he is very dependable. He and my father were best friends. I wonder if he will even listen to what I have to say. Don't worry, we're not leaving until he does. We will arrive at the upper level shortly. Sire, Princess Garnet of Alexandria wishes to speak for you. Wishes to see you. I don't even see anyone in the front. Princess, is something wrong? The region isn't here, and I don't know who. Take a look at the throne. What in the world? Greetings. Og. Love. Sire. What? Danger. What's wrong? Why aren't you talking to? Jeez, that's an ogla. Wow, even Oblix are big and limbless. What is the meaning of this? How dare you greet the princess like this? Get that repulsive bug off the throne immediately and call for the region. Please settle down, you are before the region. What? Enough of your nonsense. Steiner, stand down. I remember that mustache. Is that really you, Uncle Sid? Yes, greeting all. I am Sid Fabble, region of Limbo. I knew it was you. I recognize your pendant's description. It's so much like my Falcon Claw. I'm delighted to see you again, Garnet. You have truly become a fine lady. I, on the other hand. Allow me to explain. About six months ago, somebody snuck into the castle and attacked the region in his sleep. Unfortunately, we were too late. The region had been transformed into an Agla, and his wife, Lady Hilda, was abducted. Oh, goodness. Whoever pulled this off had to be highly skilled like me. <laughs> I'll bet it was you. That's not possible. How can you be so sure? Do you know who we are? Of course, I may be a bug, but I'm still the ruler of Limblum. Uncle Sid, I appreciate you seeing me on such short notice. I desperately need to speak to you about my mother. That's what I figured. But I'm sure I can wait till tomorrow. Why don't you all get some rest for today? Thank you. It's time for lunch. Please follow me. Alright, I 
can't stand the food at this castle. But the castle is way too high class for my taste. How can anyone get full on that stuff? The cheap food here is a lot better. Today's special is soup du, du silence. Not bad. Yo, Pops, I'll have the stupid special. Who said that? Zide, ain't. I figured it was you. How have you been? Alright, I guess. Have a seat. Your soup will be ready in a minute. Do you mind? You're standing in everyone's way. Wow. Zide so ain't all about them ladies. Hey. Yeah? Do you want a drink? How about you and Miko for a cruise on an airship? Really? An airship? Sounds like you've never been on one. You know, Limbo is quite a sight from high above. Hey, Monkey Tail, you're disturbing the other customers. What the? You've got a tail too, Rat Face. Rat Face? After I finish my drink, I'm gonna kick your butt. Hey, Zidane, take it outside. Long time, Zidane. Hey, what's up? Wait a minute, you forgot my name? No, I remember. You're Helga, right? Wrong. Christine? No! Oh yeah! You used to live next door to me. How's it going, Rachel? Man, you've really gotten big. You nasty little. Come on, I'm just kidding. You know I never forget a pretty girl's name. So, how have you been, Freya? Same old Zidane. How long has it been? About three years. Hey, did you ever find out anything about your boyfriend? No. So what brings you to Limblum? The festival on the hunt. Of the hunt. What else? It's a good opportunity to test my skills. Oh, well I'm sure you'll find them someday. Aren't you participating? Nah, I think I'll pass. You lazy bum. Are you ever going to go back? I have no reason to return to Bermishia. There's nothing there for me anymore. So how is the queen? Is she still as vibrant as ever? Yes, but since father died, mother has been acting very strangely. I'm not surprised. They loved each other so much. We haven't spoken much lately. Also, a suspicious man has been crawling around the castle. I don't know what's going on anymore. I fear that she might be planning something terrible. I brought this matter to everybody's attention, but no one has taken me seriously. They all think I'm distraught after losing my father. I understand why you are so eager. I'm happy that you come to me for help. At this point, I think you're the only person Mother will listen to. When I heard that Limblum's theater ship was coming to Alexandria, I decided to sneak on board and come here no matter what. I just never expected the crew to kidnap me. It was me. I was the one who ordered Tantalus to kidnap you. I once promised your father that I would anything, that should anything happen, I would protect you. We've known about the disturbances in Alexandria for some time. But had we acted directly, it would have started a war. So I asked Baku for help, and I go way back. Him and I go way back. The play was the perfect cover to enter Alexandria and get you out. No one would suspect Lindblom was behind it. We were forced to take action because we knew Alexandria would never seek our help. I believe we were able to get you in here. At the village of Dolly, we saw a new... Uh, saw numerous black mages. They looked like golems, controlled by some powerful magic. On top of that, they were being created under Alexandria's supervision. I don't know how they're related to Phoebe, but if Mother is planning to use them for war, we won't let that happen. Even if she were to command an army of black mages, she won't make a move as long as we have our airship fleet. Don't worry, everything will be fine. I'm so sorry, Uncle. Now oh, come on. 
Don't be so formal. I'm helping you because I'm your Uncle Sid, not because I'm the Regent of Lindblom. Thank you so much. What is this place? The heart and soul of Lindblom. Our airship dock. This is dock number one, where we conduct our research. But where are the airships? Lonely, isn't it? We had a few airship I had a new airship model in here six months ago. It was our latest creation. It didn't require mist to fly. The man who attacked you, was he the one who ran off with it? Good guess, but no, actually. I met a lovely lad at the pub. When Hilda found out about my little air affair, she used her magic and turned me into an ogla. Then she stormed off in the new airship, which I named Hildegard. Pretty ironic, eh? She hasn't been back since. Been working on Hildegard too, but it hasn't been going too well. My mind just isn't the same as an ogla. I'm hopeless. But that doesn't mean I can't help you. I'll do my best for Alexandria. Thank you, but with Southgate badly damaged, I don't know how we can get to Alexandria. Don't worry, Southgate is being repaired as we speak. Once the repairs are finished, we'll go to Alexandria. Yes, I'm sure Mother will finally open her eyes to the truth. Truth. <laughs> Uncle, is something wrong? Huh? No, I was just thinking about how the theater ship crashed. Baku sure has good men working under him. Good morning. You're up early. Limblum is really a busy place. I've never seen this many people before. I wonder where people go if they want to be alone. Limblum has always been like this. People come here from all over the world. Some of them come here to become airship engineers, sculptors, actors. Wow. Or, wow, if you're Owen Wilson. I don't even remember why I came here my first time. Before I knew it, I was living here with ta my Tantalus brothers, Tantalus. Do they still live here? Yeah, our hideout is in the theater district. I'm gonna go there right now. Do you wanna come along? Um, that's okay, I'm gonna go look around town. Okay, then I'll give you a little tour. No, that's okay, I can go by myself. Oh, okay. Go find yourself a cute girl, alright? Teach me to mugs to Ah. Uh. Okay, we might actually watch this one. In addition to regular shops where you can buy and sell items, there are synthesis shops where you can synthesize, uh, synthesize items to create new ones. All you need are two items to serve as the base and a few gil to cover labor. The items you need and the amount of money you pay vary for each synthesized item. Here are some examples. The ogre, required item, one, mage masher. Required item, two, mage masher. Cost, 700 gil. Those are boots, required item, one, leather hat. Required item, two, leather shirt. Cost, 300 gil. Yeah. If you haven't been to a synthesis shop yet, go check out the one in Limblum. Oh, speaking of synthesis, I'll tell you a big secret. Long ago, I heard rumors there's a legendary synthesis who can create the best item, but I don't know where he lives or what he looks like. Gosh, bro, you sure know a lot. Yeah, I know. Alright, we're gonna cut the video in a second, but... I can, you know, walk. There's a letter for Zedane. From Ruby. Ain't y'all coming back to Alexandria? I'm so lonely. Just kidding. I'm opening a little theater in an alley here. A bartender pal of mine is quitting the saloon and getting into showbiz. He asked me to help. Your friend is starting a, starting a mini theater. Sound like fun.
Alright, let's go ahead and save. Even though we did not too long ago. And there should be I thought there was some That looks like a chest. Boo Boo Bird statue. Bobo, whatever. Bobo birds are a symbol of good fortune according to an Oglin myth. Olgan myth. The founder of the sin bought the statue and has been passed down for generations. Well, that's not what we wanted to do. What a huge town. I'm completely lost. Pardon me. Jeez. You're dressed awfully funny. I'm Captain Adelbert Steiner of Alexandria, and I humbly request your assistance to get back to the castle. <laughs> That's a new one. Nice try, but I don't date bums. You should really scrape that rust off. It's disgusting. Whoa. Huh? Do you always strike out that badly? I think you need a new line. A little shine wouldn't hurt either. What are these things? They're called Geishel Pickles. They're one of Limblum's delicacies. Do you want to try one? It smells terrible. The worst thing. They smell, the better they taste. I guess I'll try one. Oh my, even the luck wolves don't eat them in, in one bite. But you're right, they are good. There we go, I think this is good. Okay. Alright, uh, we're gonna cut it here, guys. There's a pretty decent amount of things to do in this city, and the video's already past 43 minutes, so hope you enjoyed it. See you next time.